Hello, Blue Island residents. I hope this message finds you and your families safe and well. It appears we're beginning to turn the corner in the fight against the spread of COVID-19. With the recent positive announcements from the state of Illinois and Cook County Department of Public Health regarding loosened restrictions and greater vaccine availability. I'll be covering those important announcements in just a moment. But first, the numbers. As of January 20th, the number of Blue Island residents who have tested positive for COVID-19 is 2,597, with a total of 22,223 tested. The number of employee positive cases since March is 23. The City of Blue Island is included in Region 10 of the State of Illinois' COVID Resurgence Mitigation Plan. As of January 16th, our region's test positivity seven-day rolling average was 8.1% and the hospital admissions have been on the decline for the last 10 days of reporting. Hospital bed availability is currently above the 20% threshold. Because of those numbers, Blue Island and Region 10's restriction levels were loosened to Tier 2, effective January 19, 2021. While popular activities like indoor dining are still prohibited in Tier 2, cultural centers and museums are permitted to reopen and other small group activities may resume. For more information on Tier 2 guidelines, please visit blueisland.org. Also on January 19th, Cook County Department of Public Health announced it will expand to Phase 1B of the vaccination plan starting January 25th. The expansion to Phase 1B includes members of the general public aged 65 and over. Phase 1B also includes police, firefighters, and other essential workers, such as manufacturing employees and grocery store workers. You can sign up to receive more information directly from CCDPH about how and where to get vaccinated by visiting blueisland.org. While the vaccine is rolled out, it's still important to follow a few safety guidelines in your day-to-day -day activities. The most important being wearing a mask consistently and correctly over your nose and mouth. Avoid close contact with others and maintain a distance of at least six feet from others who do not live with you. Wash your hands often with soap and warm water and refrain from attending or hosting gatherings with people who do not live in your household. For the latest coronavirus updates and information, please visit blueisland.org slash coronavirus. This page contains resources for residents, seniors, and businesses, including the most recent updates we receive from health and safety agencies around the region and state. Thank you for your continued support, Blue Island. Be safe and be well.